Just call him Mr. Champions League. Cristiano Ronaldo now wearing the colours of Juventus, who tonight face Paris Saint-Germain in the final at the Metropolitano here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined for commentary on this final by Lee Dixon. Lee, what are you expecting? Well, I'm expecting excitement. I'm excited for those players in the dressing room. You can just see the nerves twitching behind those eyes. I'm pretty sure the whole game plan has been done before in the dressing room they know what they've got to do the difficulty is this is the Champions League final they've got to go and produce and no great surprise that Cristiano Ronaldo is the focus of everyone's attention well absolutely it was a move that took everybody by surprise but he's a serial winner he wanted to challenge himself again and he's certainly done that in this Juve side This is how Juventus will line up. Wojciech Szczesny starts in goal. And leading the attack today is the heart to contain Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's going to end in glory for one team and bitter disappointment for the other. Well, big night call for big players. And there's a few on both teams tonight. Who will come out on top? I'm pretty sure it's going to be a great game, tactically, physically. And I think we're going to get some goals as well, Derek. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Buffon begins in goal. Thiago Silva plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. And the main striker today is Edinson Cavani, the Uruguayan. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway. Who will be crowned club kings of Europe? Dybala. Possibilities for Douglas Costa. And in with a real chance. Only the keeper to beat. Well, that is a moment he would like to airbrush from history. Well, he's had an absolute nightmare there. The goal's in front of him. Just hit it. Raxler now. No surprise to see Juventus here on the big Champions League finals. stage 
a team of natural winners. Yeah, juggernaut of Italian football. They'll be confident they're going into this final, full of confidence, full of good results. Can they go that extra yard? Braxler now. It's an excellent attack from PSG, but will there be an end product? Well, is he going to give them the... Advantage! And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. few years ago we didn't really think of Paris Saint-Germain as potential Champions League winners suffice it to say Lee those days are gone well absolutely it's about time really that France and especially Paris it's still alive well very effective goalkeeping to touch it over corner coming up for Juventus the delivery courtesy of Dybala can they put it away Braxler. Kurzawa. Cavani. Quadrado dispossessed. Ronaldo. And he's broken free. Can he beat the goalkeeper? A goal for the Bianco Man. Goal for Juventus in the Champions League final. Well, finals are for heroes. Is that the goal that lifts the trophy? We'll wait and see. Well, look at this, Derek. Sometimes the opposition are all set up perfectly to dribble through them. It's almost like he's playing FIFA. He goes through and puts the ball in the back of the net. It's brilliant. Underway again with Juventus in front. Here's Mbappe. Mbappe with it. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. And he's made headway. Does he have the beating of the goalkeeper? Still a chance. Great save following the close-range effort. Look how close he gets to the goalkeeper. It's a really, really good save in the end. Very good use of advantage there by the official, letting the play carry on and then only subsequently handing out the yellow card. Yeah, absolutely, and that's what the fans want. They want to see the game going on. They don't want to see it stopped or something like that. You can always go back and book the player later. The Juventus corner forthcoming. And it's firing it over. And they deal with the threat this time. Crossing opportunity. Mbappe with it. Braxler. Rabio. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Cavani's in behind. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Others to play it to. Cavani might fancy it. Cavani! And foiled only by the crossbar. Fine reaction save from the goalkeeper. Goalkeeping at its best. Really, really top draw. And on the basis of that effort, quite clearly, he's not wearing his shooting boots at the moment. Well, it was a strong effort, used his laces, but uh, screwed it well off target. Dybala. An abundance of space. Thumped clear. Now, Rabio. Verratti good numerical situation running towards goal one man to beat and oh he's missed it good heavens well what a chance for an equaliser Derek at this level you don't get many chances and that was one of them Alexandro now well he's lost the ball any sort of lead is important they have the lead what have you made of it so far? Well, this is going well for Juve, just. It's tight, control of the ball is key when a game is like this. They have the players to do it for sure, though, but they'll be the happier the two teams at half-time. 
Dybala. Now, what can he do here? And he's knocked it out of play, so a throw-in is the decision. Now, Quadrado. Paolo Dybala waiting. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Corner for Juve. Played into the centre of the box. Attending to his defensive chores. Tremendous block. Mbappe with it. And a throw in it's going to be. Verratti. Mbappe. On a tip. Cavani! And he has just fractionally misfired. Yeah, he should have put his laces straight through the ball. Sometimes he can get too cute. Pjanic now. And plenty of scope to be creative. Kylian Mbappe. Mbappé. Surely the equaliser. A goal it is from Neymar. Left foot, right foot, knee, doesn't matter. It's in the back of the net. Well, we're going to see the replay here. You can't head the ball in the net if you don't get any crosses in. The crosses are coming in thick and fast. And that was a beauty. That made the goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Pjanic now, given away by Verratti, and Quadrado, just wanted to get it out of there, it's with Joao Cancelo, possession regained by Verratti, Quadrado, Given away. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Neymar. It is a fruitful forward run. Not messing around with that clearance. Douglas Costa. Mini eight. And the pass by Mbappe. He'll be disappointed. Ronaldo threading it through. Dybala purposefully. Quadrado. Can they get themselves in front here? Very attractive looking move. Easy on the half time then. And we're sorry for the pause in the proceedings here, Lee, because this has been a thoroughly riveting Champions League final so far. This is. Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Tremendous intuition to win it back. It might be the moment for Ronaldo. Keeper did his job to begin with. Clattered away. Throw-ins given. Well, that's a moment he would like to airbrush from history. He's thrown it straight to the opposition. That is how to put in a challenge. He's been a bit unfortunate in that the ball has gone out. Costa with it. Possession seeded by Juve. This is Thiago Silva. Braxler. Verratti now. Excellent first half from Neymar in this game, Lee. Well, lovely ball from Verratti. Dybala. The tackle completely missed time, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And the offence 
sufficiently sinister to warrant a yellow card. Yes, agree with that one, Derek. He's got to be careful now. Dybala and the decision is one of offside here Radio Minier Gavassi now PSG on the move with purpose what can they do from this particular position Attending to his defensive chores. Now Rabio. And it's Julian Draxler. An attempt like that, never likely to trouble the keeper. No, he's got positioning right, but it was a poor shot in the end. And plenty of scope to be created in that wide position. Ronaldo! You never really know, Lee, if it's going to come off when you hit it on the volley in that fashion. Yeah, hero to zero. When he struck that, you think, wow, and then all of a sudden you realise where it's gone. And a substitution in the offing. Here's Marquinhos, now Minier, half an hour remaining then, now Rabio. and it's a really good looking Paris Saint-Germain attack, what will they do next? Matuidi, Cristiano Ronaldo. In full control of the ball here. The delivery towards the back post. Clattered away. And he has just veered into an offside position this time. Substitution time it is. And the defender had the reading of that against Douglas Costa. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. Here's Mbappe. Now Minier. And the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And two substitutes on at the same time for Juve. Roselso, Mbappe, Neymar ready. The object of the exercise is to keep them out. Deski to thread it. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. Juan Cuadrado tucking it away. Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. The keeper couldn't do anything about it. PSG chasing this game. Let's see if they can succeed on that front. So 20 minutes to go. Nkunku has it. Nocelso. Here's Nocelso. Edinson Cavani now. And that is offside. Now 
Chiellini. Abrado. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Roselso. Cavani. Now Minier. Kylian Mbappe. A low trajectory ball. Goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. But he has teammates to play it to. It's gone in! A goal for PSG beyond the goalkeeper to square things up. Well, let's see that strike again. First time is always very, very difficult to strike a ball. The timing has to be right, the technique has to be right. But above all, you have to concentrate on the ball as it's coming to you. You know you're not going to take a touch. Concentration is everything. Edinson Cavani now. Quadrado. Mandzukic. Slide draw pass from Mario Mandzukic. Oh, he's not. Glorious pass from Bernardeschi. Oh, and the hero for the umpteenth time in his career, Cristiano Ronaldo. What late excitement here. Derek is simple, he's brilliant. He scores all sorts of goals and he gets winners too. Disappointing for PSG to concede the goal. And let's see if they can attack with vigour. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Precision from Mandzukic and Cristiano Ronaldo waiting. Well, far from the cross he had in mind. Goal kick it is. Thiago Silva, Diara, Roselso, Diara. Here's Marquinhos. And in the second half, the signs are positive. They can't relax me, but they ought to be pleased. Well, Juve players have to stay focused on not making any mistakes in order to protect this slender lead. If a bit of magic from the opposition gets them back in it, there's little you can do about that. It's with Mandzukic. Slide draw pass from Mario Mandzukic. Let's see what he has in store for them. Mandzukic. Can they hit on the break? It is a decent looking attack here. Oh, maybe the equaliser. What a save it was to keep them in with a shout. Well, they have kept them in the game. If that goes in, it's all over. Played into the centre of the box. Any goalkeeper. Italy's old lady has passed the final test. Juventus are the winners of the UEFA Champions League. Well, you have to say, fully deserved as well. All those months of toil, the training sessions, etc. The sacrifice, the commitment, the desire, the hunger. The luck as well, but the application to put all that into a package and then win this brilliant trophy. They do set very high standards for themselves, these Juventus players. But this is something they will remember forever. Feeling of pride it must give you to be able to say you're part of the team that's the best in Europe League. Well, you know, these players get paid fortunes, bank accounts are full of money, but it doesn't matter. It's about memories. When you finish your career, you look back at these moments. How many trophies have I won? How many times have I celebrated on a podium with this famous trophy? The buoyant Bianconeri. Juventus left the Champions League trophy. Brilliant moment, especially for the captain. He gets his hands on the trophy first. Well, they certainly intend to savour this. Juventus, and they ought to. Does it come along every night of the week? The cup with the big ears, as it's affectionately known. And this is the moment, Derek, sharing it with the supporters. You get a chance to take it a little bit closer to those stands. Let them enjoy the experience with you. And the families are up there in the stands as well. A brilliant occasion. It took fire as well as ice 
on the pitch. Necessary qualities. Now the chance for a photograph. My mum always told me to get on the front row. She taught you well, Lee. There we have it. The Champions League victors for 2019. Ronaldo, and he's broken free. Can he beat the goalkeeper? A goal for the Bianconeri. Goal for Juventus in the Champions League final. Well, finals are for heroes. Is that the goal that lifts the trophy? And plenty. And Kylian Mbappe. Verratti. Surely the equaliser. A goal it is from Neymar. Left foot, right foot, knee, doesn't matter. It's in the back of the net. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And the offence sufficiently sinister to warrant a... And it's teed up for Ronaldo. Juan Cuadrado tucking it away. He has teammates to play it to. It's gone in. A goal for PSG beyond the goalkeeper to square things up. Slide rule pass from Mario Mandzukic. Oh, he's knocking on the door. Glorious pass from Bernardeschi. Oh, and the hero for the umpteenth time in his career, Cristiano Ronaldo. What late excitement. It is a decent looking attack here. Oh, maybe the equaliser. What a save it was to keep them in with a shout. Well, the Aussie kept them in the game. If that goes in, it's all over.